Okay, we'll have a look at the star plot that occurs inside cocked hat. Vessel steering 288 at 14 knots, D opposition 1823. We observe stars A, B and C. The first two before 1823 and the third one after. So 12 to 23 is 11 minutes at 14 knots. We have to plot 2.6 miles after the 1823. Star B 1.6 after and star C 0.7 before. Working out the bearings there and true tiny away because it's altitude rather than zenith distance and we get the three values to plot. And as it says here, as the bearings are um, exceed 180 apart, the MPP will be inside the cocked hat. So let's have a look at the first um, sketch. There's our course of 280. Star A, 042, 7.7 .7 away. B, 282, 9.2 away. And C, 159 at 6.3 towards. Okay, so that's the three. So the large green triangle will be our cocked hat. Now this one's towards. So when we plot our second line, we'll do it towards that position. This one is away. So when we plot our second line, we'll plot it this side. And this one, of course, is away. So we'll have one line here, one here, and one there. So let's have a look how it looks. First line there. This line 159 is towards. This line is away. And this one here of course is away. Okay, so the 042 and the 282 are away. And the 159 is towards. So I've got a green square on the original cocked hat, I've, in red, I've plotted the, the equidistant lines, and I've put a circle around each one, and then I've put a line from the circle through the square, from the circle through the square, circle through the square, and that gives us our MPP. So from that we can measure our DLAT, and we can measure our departure. So that's the plot where we have a cocked hat and we are actually inside the cocked hat and that's the values that I plotted and that's the position that I estimate our MPP will be for this um, particular plot.